hey y'all what's up welcome back to the channel welcome if you are new hey girl hey i'm really excited as you could probably tell i'm obsessed with this wig spoiler alert okay i just gotta tell you right off the bat i'm obsessed i love these highlights okay it's so pretty let's get into it we're gonna be reviewing this wig today we're gonna be doing some styling and things so let's get into it Hey y'all, so today's wig is brought to you by Nadula. You already know what their packaging looks like. They always have the little goodies inside, but let's get into the wig. Do you see the front tool? It's front tilling, okay? It looks really, really nice. This is their 13 by 4 blonde highlight frontal wig and the highlights are also highlighting okay <laughs> but this is the 24 inch length and the highlights really do look nice this is the body wave texture and the wig is just your typical construction combs on the side combs in the back adjustable straps and an elastic band this has the elastic band that goes from one side to the other so yeah, this is just what the wig looks like. I'll be back after our co-wash. Hey y'all, so this is what the wig looks like after it has been co-washed and air dried. I don't know why there's like no curl pattern up here at all. And it's only at the bottom. It's kind of low key a vibe though, but like I was very surprised when I was washing this wig. Like why is this part not curling up? Like what's going on? But um, yeah, this is what it looks like after it has been air dried um uh, i think i might run the blow dryer through it just because i really plan on doing like a lot of crazy layers in this wig and a lot of voluminous curls well not voluminous but like just like loose curls i should say i don't know why i said voluminous but yeah so i want it to be kind of like straight and it still kind of looks a little like the wet look and I don't want it to look like that so yeah I think I might run the blow dryer through it but yeah we're about to get to styling this wig I love this color I love the highlights in it it's so pretty I'm like on a highlight wave right now like I'm loving highlights but yeah my so, baby loves me right Let good loving day and night get it always in my side get it make me feel alright my baby loves me right My baby, they cool me down It ain't always been my side It didn't make me feel alright Not only you Baby, I said not only you Not only you did my mind Not only you get my time Hey, you know I got the magic for you I got the magic for you I got the magic for you Okay, so it is the next day and now I'm about to just literally cut the lace off and then put some powder on the top side of the part and then we'll be done. Okay, so... <gasps> the part not straight. Oh man. Now I'm gonna have to go on. Oh my god, the part is not straight. I didn't straighten the part. <gasps> I love this. It's my kind of wig, baby. This is my kind of wig. Yeah. Okay. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. I love this. This is my kind of wig. <laughs> okay, but first, let me tell you. I did not part this wig in the middle correctly. Like, it's more to the side. And I didn't realize I went through the washing. Because when I wash my wigs, that's when I part them. And I went through the whole washing process and all of that. And the styling, like I showed you me curling the wig and everything with the parts just crooked and never even realized 
But when I just put it on and I lined it up by, you know, using the combs to navigate and then each ends of the lace to navigate and it was not in the middle. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, it's too late though because I already cut it, <laughs> curled it, everything according to this being the middle. So it just is no turning back. So I kind of have my wig shifted a little bit over to the side just so we can keep the part in the middle because I'm just, I can't, I, I, how did I do that? Somebody please tell, how did I do that? But forget about that. I'm obsessed with this wig. I love this wig. Let me tell you a couple of things, okay? First of all, I love the highlights because I'm just, I don't know what's going on. I'm, I'm in a highlight phase. Like I'm loving highlights. That's the first thing, right? But then also, a lot of the times with like wigs and wig companies, you look at the pictures on the website and it has the wig looking a certain color, a certain kind of blonde, a certain kind of this, a certain kind of that. And then you get the wig and it's too brassy or it looks just, the color just looks nothing like the picture. This looks exactly like the picture. They got the highlights right on this one, baby. Okay? They did that. Are you crazy? This is so pretty. Also, you know the type of girl I am, I don't feel like doing the most. Although this is a 13 by 4 frontal, it has the frontal. But it doesn't require you to do a lot. I literally put some foundation on the underside of the part and then I put some um, foundation powder and eyeshadow on the top side and that was really that on that like you know what i'm saying and that's just my kind of wig i like it nice and easy you know i will say though i thought that this wig was going to be a little bit fuller now i'm not mad at the density i like the density but as you saw i'm trying to like fluff it up just to give it a little bit more something because for one i don't have any hairspray but also because like from the photos it looked like it was going to be just a lot fuller and it's really not again i'm not mad at the density i'm not like this wig is too thin no I just was expecting it to be a little bit thicker and fuller. Now, I'm not mad at it. Like I said, I like it. But if I had some hairspray, then that would have really, like, did it. Because I just want it to be, like, a little bit more, like, you know. And because it's a more, like, um, silky kind of a texture, like, as far as, like, it being, like, kind of, like, silky straight. Well, technically, this is a body wave wig. But you know what I'm saying. Like, it's just, like, a little bit more flat, and I haven't really been wearing, like, te wigs this texture, like a more silky texture. So, you know, it was just kind of like, oh, I ain't have a little flathead wig in a long time, girl. But the color is everything. I love it. Like, I love the curls. Like, it just came out so cute. Here is the parting. Like I said, I literally just added some foundation to the underside. And then I always like to go in with a lighter, like this light eyeshadow before I go in with my foundation powder just because sometimes this could be a little bit orange and it doesn't really look like my scalp. As you can see, like right here is kind of white. Whereas like here's where my bronzer is at. <laughs> so it could just kind of look a little off sometimes. So I like to go in with the almost like white and then go over top of this because it, you know, makes it look like my scalp. But listen, I, I would say run to the internet right now and get this wig if you love the color. Because I feel like as far as the construction, the length, and the texture of the wig, that's not really anything special. No shade. It's not really anything special. But what makes it special is the highlights in it. Like they got it all the way right with these highlights it looks beautiful also this wig is big head friendly i have the adjustable strap adjusted all the way to the other side and then i even have the adjustable straps that start like embedded in the wig cap um adjusted a little bit i don't have them adjusted all the way across but i do have it adjusted a little bit so this wig is big head friendly for the bigger head girls but yeah, y'all, this wig is two thumbs up from me. I say, like, go and get it, okay? If you are interested, all of the links will be in the description box for you to check it out. Once again, shouts out to Nadula Hair for sending me over this wig and collaborating with your girl on today's video. Be sure to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you are not subscribed. And I'll catch you in the next one. Enjoy the rest of your week, your weekend, whatever it may be. Peace and blessings. Bye. I'm feeling so cute. Like, I'm really not even about to play with you. Like, I feel so cute in this. All right, bye for real.